Had it who's been before? Make some noise. Yay. Okay, 12 people. Repeat custom, <laughs> not good. Uh, who's never been before? Please. New people down the front. And a lot of people didn't cheer. You didn't cheer at all then, mate. So have you been before? You've not been before? You don't understand the fucking question? Like... <laughs> You did not understand the question, but you understood that question. Uh, <laughs> what's your name, man? Steve. Steve. Are you in show business yourself, Steve? No. So then what the fuck are your feet doing on the stage? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking, Steve. Let's have a laugh, mate. Where are you from, Steve? Leeds. Leeds. And do you live in Liverpool now, or are you still in Leeds? Still in Leeds. Still in Leeds. So what are you doing here? Your culture vultures. <laughs> I don't like you anymore. <laughs> you, can't, you can't just give yourself a rhyme and nickname and pretend it's cool. Uh, have you ever been here before, Steve? The no. no. Okay, cool. So you haven't been before. And who are you here with tonight? Um, my wife, Terry. Y your wife, Terry. Hello, Terry. You're okay. Uh, how long have you been with Steve? 40 years. Fuck me. <laughs> Can't be asked with that. Can I, like, can anyone be forty years together? Yeah. No, no. You've been together forty nine years. Not, Not with her, with your husband. <laughs> you what? Six. You're twins. Okay, this is odd, isn't it? Uh, what a weird start to the show. We've been together longer since the womb. Are you 67 year old twins? Yeah. That's quality, that, isn't it? What's your name? Jean. Jean. <laughs> Jean and Wendy. They are nice names, aren't they? Where are you from? Nottingham. Nottingham. Oh, what, what? There was a noise then, wasn't there? <laughs> Do you hear a noise then? Yeah, we did. What was it? Was it a phone or something? <laughs> I mean, I'm absolutely going to look at you now, aren't I? <laughs> I didn't kill anyone, honest. Don't put me in prison. What? If you phone, just pop your phone on silent for us, or if it goes, because if it goes off again, I'm going to answer it. And I'll say fucking horrible things. He can't come to the phone right now, he's choking on my cock. I'll say something like that. And the person on the other end will not like it. Uh, so, <laughs> we've got Jean and we've got Wendy. So, welcome, girls. Uh, do you still live in Nottingham? And you've travelled up for the gig, or? Uh, for three days. For three days. Been to Liverpool before? No, first time in Liverpool. Yeah. What, what, did you only get here today? Sunday. You got here yesterday. Yeah. And what have you seen so far? Where have you been? I've been all around, I've been on the tour and everything. On the tour? Yeah, on the tour. Of the whole city or like just like the Slavery Museum and that? <laughs> have you been in the Slavery Museum yet? Yeah. It's ma mad that we've got a museum for that, isn't it? Like we're proud of it. <laughs> <laughs> I have you been there? Did you go? Yeah. It's a piss take that place. I don't know. Has anyone else been? Do you know in the Slavery Museum, in the entrance foyer, there's a donations bowl, and this is true. And on the donations bowl, it says, our staff work for free. <laughs> <laughs> it's, not, it's not a museum if it's still happening, is it? You know what I mean? Like, fucking sweatshop, and he's shutting down. <laughs> so you've, you've been a sl I'll come back to you in a minute, Steve, if that's all right, mate. Just... De dealing with some other people over here. Because um, you've been to Liverpool before, this is their first time, just trying to make sure they are taking all the sites and stuff. So, uh, you've done the Slavery Museum, you've been to the Cavern? Yeah. Okay. Uh, did you go all around the Albert Dock and see all of that area? Yeah. Been to Constant Square yet? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you've been on the walking tour? You've been to Not a Screen? <laughs> not a Screen. Oh, you got to go to Not a Screen, it's fucking lovely. It looks exactly like it sounds, greenery, like loads of trees. I mean, they're in bags, but there's trees there. Uh, <laughs> that's where you should go, check, get in a taxi tomorrow, not a screen. Make sure the taxi driver takes you via fucking scam. Uh, <laughs> so, Steve, welcome, mate. You've got boat shoes on there, I like that. That's a confident man. Uh, and you, so you've been together 40 years, and you've been together with your husband 49 years, but he's not here. He's still in Nottingham. Okay, you didn't. You can't be. You, you want to break, don't you? Yeah, Forty-nine years is fucking long enough. So you'll come to Liverpool with your sister. Do you two get on? Yeah. Like really well. Yeah. Twins tend to, don't they? I hate my little brother. 
I do, I hate him, he's a dickhead. Do you know him or something? You do know him? How fucking, you know Jack? That is fucking freaky, I'll be honest with you. That is my little brother's name. He's a gobshite, have you ever, have you ever seen Jack drunk? It's fucking horrendous, isn't it? He fell asleep in town the other day. I, I believe you. I absolutely believe you. It's a fucking liability, lightweight prick. He only ever rings me for two things. Will you take his dog for a walk? And can I have money? That's all you ever hear from him. Do you get that with each other? No. In unison as well? No. We are the twin robots. No. You've been together 40 fucking years and, and you're still going strong. You're still in love? <laughs> I don't, don't judge them. He passed them on the back there. Do you know him? You don't know him. You're just like, I feel you, mate. I get it. Yeah, yeah. Are you guys a couple as well? How long have you guys been together? Thirty-one, and it's the same, isn't it? You just like you, you love each other, but you don't want to. That's the thing. <laughs> love is inconvenient. After a while, I've been with my girlfriend two years, and I love her, but I don't fucking like it anymore. <laughs> Like, just change, you, the way you look at the person you're with just changes slightly over the years, doesn't it? Just slightly. Like, you start new relationship and you, you're thinking things like, you look at them and think, I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. And now I look at my girlfriend and think, if she died today, it wouldn't ruin me week. That's where... <laughs> <laughs> It'd ruin me day, don't get me wrong. Me day would be a fucking write-off. A few pints with the lads and a good Liverpool result. I'll be swiping right by Sunday, you know what I mean? Ha, ha, ha.